So yeah, I'm Brandon. Um, I'm here to show you a little trick. I had a little problem with my um, with my fuel gauge. Um, I don't care if you follow me, like, subscribe. I don't really care. I'm just I'm just putting here for maybe some views or something like that. I'm wearing the mask because I don't want to catch any COVID or something like that right through the video, um, watching you watching me and all that stuff or whatever. But it's all cool. It's all good. But here I just want to help you because this. This could take a whole trip to the car doctor, and you don't want to do that. Uh, I think I did it the right way. I think it's all right. Gas is getting a lot more expensive these days. So, uh, right, so, um, right here, you got your fuel gauge. It was, like, around, you know, a quarter tank. And then what I did was... I went to the back. Your fuel pump should be underneath your seat, right back, around your underneath your back seat. But your actual fuel, you know, like where all your fuel is stored, is underneath your car. So you want to get like something like a piece of wood, I had, you know, or like a rubber mallet is most uh, appropriate. And then you're gonna want to tap on it like this. See how it's all underneath here, right? This, this, this. Tap on it lightly, or heavier, or lightlier, or light, I don't know. You wanna knock that there's a black piece on your fuel pump. You want to knock that in place. Sometimes it just doesn't kick in. There's other reasons. But right away, the, um, the fuel gauge went back up. Well, I put $30 worth of gas in here. And it only got me like, see it's going up a little bit more right here. I went up to a half tank. Anyway, that's how you get your fuel gauge unstuck. So if you want, if you want to know that, just check out my channel or whatever.